So Armand is putting his mom's keepsake under the headstone. Is it not fitting? Oh, let's just show us. Put a little Mary Golden with her hair. It matches those daylilies pretty very yeah. nicely, actually. Let's see, where are those day daylilies out here? Lots of them. Lots, of, yeah. They're all gone by our house, but. So this is um, grandma's brother, sister, and brother. And then grandma and grandpa over there. And then when mom, grandma goes, she's going to be in the middle. Meryl's going to be here on the end. And I'm going to be on the far side. Because we're going to do a burial on top. There's plenty of room here. Yeah, they don't know that. Yeah, yeah. I was talking here. to him this yeah, morning. So find your best spot that you're going to put your mom's memorial and push it in there as far as you can with your long fingers. And then you can do it. Do we want to make it retrievable again? No. By, not even by us? No. Good. I can do that then. There's plenty of space down here beneath. This is like... It's, it's, it's basically a, a burial. Yeah. So she will, nothing can disturb her. Meryl, you get to be by grandma and grandma. Grandma and mom and everybody. It's St. Peter, St. Paul. This is where you belong. Your son's putting you here. What are you doing? I'm Don't make the hole too big so something... No, I'm going to make it a little bit deeper and then I'll put some dirt on top. Oh, okay. Good idea. He's got the good ideas. Oop. I learned it all from Buddy. Learned it all from Buddy digging under the fence. Oh. Wow, the, the, the headstone goes pretty deep. Uh, it, it, there's a plenty of space right underneath here, though. Just so it doesn't, it can't get moved or retrieved, or someone doesn't go, what were they doing over there, and try to pull it out. And it's perfectly centered, too. Because <laughs> symmetry is a must when you're going into the afterlife. So Meryl's going to be under Thomas. Mom will be under her sister Joy, and I will be under Chris. And we'll be right by the railroad, and right by Jesus. Who never gave the little boy legs. <laughs> Grandma, aka mom, Gloria is going to um, try and say she's going to donate money to try to re have that statue um, revamped. Yeah, I'll just put s stuff in there. I wish, I wish there was a tool so you could like push it way down in there. I don't know too many people that are going to dig under a headstone unless they saw us out here and we're like, hmm, are they burying jewelry or something? It's not too bad right where we are. No, it's not hot at all. No. It's really nice. Yeah, as soon as we turned on uh, north, it got like really nice I think that's going to be pretty secure. Oh, it's very secure right now. I'm going to put some more right there. I don't want to dig up here. How much dirt do you want to put on top of it? Well, there's like... There were already before before I started. There's already there. holes under it. Yeah, so I'm trying to fill up those holes so it's not accessible. There we go. That's a good. There. We go. I just want to make sure when they ever enter Grandma that they don't, they aren't digging and accidentally dig that up. Yeah. Because that's. Bad juju. There's no standard for a burial. It can be hair in a resin, or it can be a giant a, a giant casket. Personally, I think hair and a little see-through thing is better. Takes up less of the... Plus, it's here in the United States with people that loved you your whole life. And you're going to meet new people.
Okay. I love you, Mayor. Now you're back where you should be. Wait here. We love you. Grandma and Grandpa are right next door. And our mom made sure that it's nice and secure. Your son. Love you. See you sometime.